Hey, good morning, everybody. This is Timmy with Bend Outdoors. It's very dark out. It's probably 5 in the morning, I think. 526, according to the clock. Uh, I like to come out here to China Hat Road area and do a hike on Bessie Butte and catch the sunrise. But as you know, we've been having a lot of smoke in the area this week, so not too sure what the sunrise is going to be like. But we'll come out and check it out and uh, come along and see what it's like. top of Bessie Butte on this smoky morning, August 21st, 2018. Yes, no views to be had yet, but if I look right above me, I see some blue sky, or what I think my heart and my mind hopes and wishes is blue sky, but we might have some pretty sunrise colors with the smoke in the air, and uh, I always love just coming up here and hanging out. I really like this snag tree right behind me for some reason. I'm a big fan of snag. But yeah, it's a big flat space up here. Fun spot to have a picnic. So if you want to come down and check out Bessie Butte yourself, what you're going to do is travel down Knot Road 27th on the east side of Bend. Once you get to China Hat, you're going to hang a left eastbound on China Hat. And you'll go about 4.2 miles and you'll see Bessie Butte off to your right south and there's gonna be a road there Forest Service Road 1810 signed Swamp Wells hang a right there so you'll be heading south we'll go about another two tenths of a mile and you'll see the trailhead off to the right hand side there's usually plenty of parking there a couple big pullouts on either side of the road so uh, this trailhead does get visited a bit but not nearly as much as different locations up the Cascade Lakes Highway so you're pretty much assured to find a parking spot There's Bessie Butte in the distance. We just hiked up that smoky morning. And now we're down here uh, off a of spur road on China Hat. And this is unfortunately extremely common out here. Uh, looks like someone camped out here. We have shotgun shells all over the place. Um, Pinnacle vodka cans, like seriously people. Some gross vodka beer cans, shotgun shells. So once again, I'm gonna spend a little time picking up some trash, unfortunately. People seem to think they can just leave their junk everywhere out here on our public lands, which is just tragic. Come out here, party, and leave the mess for another person. That's a little bit disappointing. I tend to expect to find shotgun shells and trash out here, but whoever's been hanging out here has really done a number on this spot. I uh, just spent about 15 minutes cleaning up. All I had was uh, an Amazon box to fill up here, but as you can see, uh, it is jam-packed with all sorts of goodies. 